Okay. Let's get a bit more lighting in the here. Ah, too much lighting in here. Might be enough. I don't think that's doing things for me. That makes me look better, doesn't it? Don't believe in Photoshop, but I do believe in lighting. Ooh, that looks much better. Let's turn that on. Ah! Ooh, close to the truth, huh? Truth hurts. All right, guys, I am just talking with you right now while I'm getting ready. I wanted to talk to you about fat loss on the face and why when I, yeah, I just did them with some hairspray, yeah? It's my fave. So make me ears, they look good for the rest. They gotta go with the rest of the red and but break it up a little bit. And what is the accent I am doing? I do not know. I'm not concerned as I move forward with forming a course of eight fortnightly radio frequency treatments using my Exilis radio frequency and ultrasound device. I'm a 45 year old woman and I've not been keeping up with my RF and microneedling uh, or even my uh, microcurrent muscle treatments that I used to have religiously after uh, discovering them led to me not only being able to give away doing injectable fillers that were making my face look strangely swollen um, and kind of puffy and I lost all definition in my cheekbones. Yeah, I've not been doing any of that really for the last two years. So I'm just being flat tack with my business and I've really not been doing the treatments I need to hold my skin up. So I'm not concerned as I uh, go on from last night. I did a double time BTL radio frequency treatment on my face and the right side of my neck. Why only those areas? Because I couldn't be faffed after that. Guys, it's, it's a lot of hard work to do your own treatments, it really is. Um, so tonight I will do the left side and I will, I also did the very first of my 10 um, microcurrent muscle treatments. So I started those and I'm really excited to be getting back into those because I'll be talking to my clients a lot about um, the, ben the, the benefits of transitioning from a skin only uh, treatment regime to a skin and muscle treatment regime. Because we all should be doing microcurrent muscle work as we mature. Uh, we need to keep the scaffolding, the muscle, muscles beneath the skin, we need to keep them lifted, toned and sculpted. You know, once we get into that 50s um, uh, uh, time in our life, you know, stuff gets really serious. So we need to not only work to repair and rebuild the skin, but we also need to repair and rebuild the muscles because we lose fat loss on our face, particularly between the ages of like 50 to 70, really between 50 and 60 is where I get a lot of new clients coming to me saying, oh my gosh, it's all happened. But they don't think of the balloon, which is being slowly siphoned of its air, just very, very tiny little bit at a time, you know, since our mid thirties, that's thinning skin. I'm not scared about uh, jumping into a course of BTL radio frequency treatments because it cannot remove fat on my face. Now, why do I say that? Because for the last nine years, I have been working to repair and rebuild the structure of their face. So even if we got lovely tight skin and, you know, I removed a certain portion of fat on their face, I would be out of a job because even the most subtle um, removal of fat on a mature age woman, um, as I perform my skin thickening wonders, um, and even sometimes start to address the muscles beneath. So that's the difference between my five stage facelifting treatments and my four stage facelifting treatments. The difference is that after we finish thickening the skin with radio frequency, we um, work to repair it and rebuild the muscles. That's the difference between 
the four and the five stage. So I am not scared, I mean I'm very excited to be repairing and rebuilding my skin as well as the muscles beneath because I've really been seeing it in the videos, the how-to videos that I've been providing my clients. I've been looking quite scary when I've gone to edit those videos uh, because even though I put in the work, you know, since I opened this practice nine years ago as far as repairing and rebuilding my skin, using technologies that I'd found throughout my own personal skin journey. My skin started aging or showing signs of aging in my ripe, well, my ripe old uh, late 20s. I am not gifted genetically when it comes to thinning skin and even depleting muscle mass. But I would be out of a job if I removed fat on women's faces and I certainly would not want to remove fat on my own face. And even when we want to rem remove fat, the really interesting thing here, guys, I've seen the doctors on YouTube talking about um, anything that creates heat can certainly affect fat on the face. You know, I've got to say, for the last nine years, I not only have worked to repair and rebuild women's faces and the skin of their neck and even the muscles of their neck now, I have also provided body sculpting treatments. And I'm going to tell you, it is bloody hard to remove fat on the body, even when you've got the best technology and you're reaching temperatures between 42 and 46 degrees for lengths of time. Okay, and that's really uncomfortable. So it is really hard to not only get those picture-perfect um, uh, results that many suppliers um, and um, manufacturers of equipment like to pretend is the norm. It's not. Body treatments, particularly on the maturing woman, are a nightmare because you are working against hormones, you're working against people having um, emotional attachments to food. You can't control what your client does when they leave your clinic, okay? So many times when I start a package of body treatments with my clients, and I work to try and keep them so like really, really cheap so that they can maintain treatments on their faces, right? Because that's what I specialize in. So I give them a great deal and they're really hard work for me and I do not make a lot of profit from them. I want it to be a bonus for my girls, but I am using the very highest in the aesthetic grade equipment um, well, that side of things. I'm now using the Exilis. Before that, we used the Venus Freeze. It's the same as the, um, the larger Venus units. Um, Trust me, guys. Just those hand pieces have a suction element, so they pull the flesh into the into the hand piece, and then they provide the RF. But trust me when I tell you, it's essentially the same technology as I've been using, which is a older unit called a Venus Freeze. And before that, I used a Venus Swan. I've been doing this for nine years, using the very best equipment I can, and it is really hard to melt fat on the body, even when you're using much stronger, much um, uh, more powerful body hand pieces. Okay, which you would not use on the face. They're not comfortable, okay, for one. Um, and then two, um, they, uh, it would be dangerous. You remove fat from even places like where we want to remove fat, which Haifu can help with. But guys, got to tell you, um, fat loss, when it comes to anywhere near the face, even here, you know, you've got to provide really uncomfortable treatments and I, t I tell my clients, don't mess with fat because it, you may think that you're going to be happy with, say, reduced fat through here and here because we can use the high food um, and a setting that causes fat reduction. Um, maybe, maybe not everybody gets that sculpting under here, guys. Most of the time, it only affects the skin. It's hard to reduce fat. So, of course, I don't mess around with the high food settings. Uh, when I deal with somebody with thin skin because I know it potentially can affect fat. But I'll tell you, even with my clients, that we are trying to decrease fat. It's hard. Skin repairing and rebuilding, I'm very confident on. But as far as fat loss, yes, you can get it with the body devices. Yes, you can get it with something like Morpheus 8. But you'd have to use the body settings. And why would you use those settings on the face? 
there would be no no reason to do that so after nine years of spending hours last night i did a double time exilis treatment on my face okay on my face on my face eight minutes and 30 minutes here 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 then i did like 16 a double treatment here you know what i'm going to get after eight of those thick strong skin that's going to help to disguise or to decrease the look of cragginess, yeah, fine lines and wrinkles. Because even though my face is still full, because I've got some fat in my face, which I'm not worried about the exilis dissolving because it's not going to do that. Why do I know that? Why do I know that? Because I spend all day using the device, guys, on mature age women's faces. If it removed fat, I would come undone very, very fast. So it's not a thing. It can happen with some RF and a particularly injectable RF devices. But guys, you would have to use um, a handpiece that's meant for the body on the face and you would have to be a practitioner that um, is not worth your salt because you wouldn't do that. You wouldn't mess with fat on the face. Okay, so I'm not worried. I look forward to sharing the results of my, my course of treatments as I repair and rebuild the muscles of my face and neck. neck. Can't talk today. And I will also uh, be sharing um, the results of the Exilis Ultra 360. I'll be showing it, repair and rebuild the skin of my face, my neck, and even my little paws, even my hands, because guys, they're looking so old. They are looking so old. So this is the first of Jessie Cat's musings. This is a segment that I'll be sharing weekly, usually on a Sunday before heading out with hubby. All right, Jessie Cat's Maddie Spa, hoping that she shares information with you that will empower you to make the right decisions when choosing treatments and practitioners for your individual needs. And I'm sharing from experience, guys. Don't trust anything I don't see myself. Can't trust anybody. Yeah, we're all trying to sell you something. Bye.